a million dollar prize pool plus 12 of the best poker players to ever exist. Buckle up for the ride and get ready to scream. Coming up, it's Battle of the Egos as the Mouths go into overdrive in the Premier League. Already, backs are up as the players have been waiting an hour for the fish. We're gonna start with Ashley next time, for sure. Yeah, you, you can't disrespect back. everybody like this. Everybody's upset at you. you. Tell you the Everyone's here waiting for you. <laughs> I might go on tilt now. What the fuck's it got to do with you? What, what they've, already, they've already you? told me outside. You don't need to start shouting I'm your big mouth off because there's a TV camera. It has everything to do with him. He's yes. been waiting for you. They're all screaming the big mouth off in the studio and acting tough, so I might have to knock some of his teeth out, actually. Because they're idiots, you know what I mean? They're all divas. They all think they're something special and we kept them waiting, you know what I mean? In the studio, it doesn't get any calmer. Anybody says how bad to me, I'm going to be arguing. Is that how you argue with your kids, Annie? My children behave better than you. They're worth listening to. Going into tonight's match, Tony G has a game in hand on the other three in the promotional zone. He has a chance to consolidate his lead, or he wouldn't want to repeat Roland Wolf's feat of winning the first and beggling number two in the playoff zone. Marcel Lusk with six points, but Annie Duke and Kravchenko in good spot this evening. A top three placing would catapult them into the promotional zone. Eddie Sharp in action as well, and looking to improve on his three points, third from last time. In the relegation zone, Ian Fraser with three points, but he's already played twice. Huge night for Phil Helmuth. He'll be disappointed with his two points from last time and looking to get into the playoff zone at least. And the Devilfish, only one point last time out, one of the pre-tournament favorites. The Devilfish has to have a big night this evening. Lend your ears, countryman, because this is going to be a loud one. Fourth match of the Premier League season. It's going to be tough for me to play, I'll tell you. I'm going to have any feeling me up on that side and any feeling me up on this side. He's at it already. The big Brit Dave, the Devilfish, only in. Chips on this table. 1,000 are the yellows, 2,000 for the blues, 5,000 for the reds, 100,000 per player, 600K in play. Here with Vicky Cord and Vicky. This is kind of like a level eight gale. Yeah, this is fairly terrifying to look at. I'm glad I'm not sitting there. The thing is, it's really crucial on the points because Kravchenko and Duke, you know, they're really in contention if they can get good points tonight. I just thought you move in on me this time. And of course, Tony G, if he can score one or two finish, is nearly, nearly on the final table. It's a first position raise from the first. Oh, this is trouble for Annie Duke. It really is. And I mean, she'd do very well just to take off a flop here. I don't think she can. I think she's got a raise. She has to trek right. To and what yeah. if the devil oh, fish baby. pushes? Pass. She's made, I think she's made a minimum raise nice here. Hand, Nearly a minimum, 12,000 more. You perhaps. know, I'm supposed to slow play this, what but. Do you mean, um, what do you mean you don't know? I don't know. I'm so lucky at the studio, so I'm just going to move it all in there. Look at this, he's telling her his hand. Oh. Will she oh, believe? What does this nice oh, hand mean? You don't know if I have a nice hand. She's, she can't call it all in re raise, can she? Nice pot. Nice pot. What does she think of the devil fish? I mean, if, if you're yeah, sitting at that table, he looks like a guy who might be speeding, doesn't he? Or does he? I'm worried about the devil fish, actually, because, uh, well, she has passed. And this all move. you know, what's he scared of? Do you know what I mean? He's one of the greatest players in the world. I normally would slow play that on the head there, but I'm winning so bad down here. I thought I'd better get it where it was at. King? You can ask, you can ask some people later. They'll tell you all they have. David. They don't come any bigger than the Devilfish. WSOP bracelet holder and current European Player of the Year. He loves the life and works as hard as he plays. It's a bit of a James Bond lifestyle without the bullets. You know, I'm 
dad these days. He used to have the bullets as well. You know, my mum and dad did the best, and that's all you can do. And then they kicked me up the ass out the door when I was 15, and I had to go make a life for myself. And I'm glad they did, because now it toughened me up, you know, you've got to be, you know, you can't be, uh, if you're travelling around the place I used to travel, you know, you can't really be a mammy's boy. But nobody ever helped, it was all trial and error, you had to, you, had, you went skint, you know, you had to, I mean, I went skint for, I've been skint more times than uh, a lot of people, but, um, you know, you had, you had to learn, the hard way, hard way to earn an easy living. All Devilfish is saying at the moment is, I'm going to get unlucky, I was unlucky in Premier League before, I will be again. It's so. like he wishes it upon himself. Jeez, it was a. I'm just thinking it was a nice little fold by any of those two tens. Uh, no, easy. Huh? All her you chips, level here. one, a re raise. Devilfish is going to know she's got something. I want five. I think she's got two queens. He might get on, but he, she knows he's got a hand that beats tens for that kind of play at this stage. Raise from G under the gun. Second time on the trot. An action from the blinds. Yeah. Flop with the nuts, baby. You can imagine an action flop with these hands out there. Yeah, you can, really. That queen 10 would be interesting. Wow. That has hit Duke. Check. 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 That's a Christmassy flop for <laughs> Annie Duke, the three wise men. <laughs> three wise men. She, she, she said, uh oh. That could be a uh, great Tony of Flush Drill. Check. I think she can check it again here. Or should she? Well, seeing Tony G's hand, I think she should. But uh, he might raise. If he's got a draw to what he feels is the nuts, that's exactly the kind of time he puts the pressure on. He's just called. Plus. This is a really key card on the end here. Oh, full house. Yeah. But I think uh, no action from Tony G, I really think. It's a saucy little it. check. 20,000. Oh, what a check. She's, <laughs> She's checked it, Jesse. She's checked it and induced the bet. I love it. You know, I, you have to feel like she was watching Tony's first heat, Vicky, because it, this is how it happened. He just couldn't help oh, himself. Yeah. He just could not help himself. Wow. No, well, the, an obvious pass for Tony G now. He knows that the femme fatale has tricked him. It was a honey trap. That river check. But he was better unlucky. go back to your old fucking you know then. He was yeah, unlucky. Still a full cool table, but yeah. he played Devil so fast with people kept moving on him with he Queen 10 when he had Ace Queen and he lost one. Yeah. Oh, I saw that. This is a very unusual tournament, Jesse, because the players get to watch the matches they're not in. But he never slowed down. So they're full of theories about what everyone's doing. It's great, isn't it? Everybody is aware of every hand that everybody has played in this match. And like nobody invites. Like she just got out of the psych ward, guys. There's so she much double think. It's insane. Yeah, was, uh, they're like, talking about how uh, so Shaw so played cool. so much more loosely in his so first heat. But look at him now, passing the ace <coughs> ten. Yeah. Yeah. Devilfish is cool with a hand that's a long way behind, but he's hit the queen. Yeah. I mean, Vicky, if if you're Kravchenko or any of the players at this table, how are you looking at the Devilfish now? I mean, you want to bluff him? Do you want to believe him? Seven thousand. I think right now. I would believe that I could bluff him, except that I can see the queen in his hand, so I know I couldn't. But you don't blame uh, Krochenko for giving it a go. And the fish look trying to represent a draw by flat calling. That is a great card for the devil fish, and it could get Kravchenko hooked. Yeah, devil fish really wants the Russian to think that he's on some kind of draw to make a big bet. Oh no, no but he's not falling for it. No, you're forcing me to bet when I miss this draw. I think Krevjanko now come. feels that with a jack in his hand, it's probably good enough. And he doesn't need to bet, but... Oh! <laughs> it's so unlucky for the fish! Yeah, actually, the fact that it was a spade, Vicky, that, that saved the fish a, lot, a little bit of money here, didn't it? Oh, fuck. Wow. <laughs> and it did, really but uh, even so, wow. waited until so he'd gone behind to make the bet. <laughs> If it hadn't have been a spade, you're right, a lot gets unlucky shoveled in, the fish could be walking. But still, unlucky. It's an unlucky river card. Fucking hell, baby. You're worse than Amanda. Yeah, I'm lucky. It's a big uh, check, but the same way. Yeah. Vicky, uh, obviously the devil fish, that was, you know, an unlucky beat on the river, but you said he, he doesn't seem to have his confidence. He feels he's going to lose, and it's like uh, he's getting his wish. Yeah, and that would have been so bad for morale. That king coming down will just serve to convince the devil fish he's right, that he's yeah, out of form. Oh, the devil fish going to make a move. Squeeze play? 
Looks like it. Not a bad spot, actually, because Helmuth will certainly pass, and Scharf may feel it's not a strong enough hand to take a stand at this level. Uh, uh, this feels dangerous to me, Vic. Yeah, I don't know. Is Helmuth it? is passing. I don't know what this performance is about, but he's certainly passing. It's supposed to fold, but let me just see what the read says. <laughs> I'm trying to think how I can possibly act here. Nice. <laughs> I knew I wasn't, why I wasn't looking at him. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a lot better luck. Helmuth, predictably enough, makes the pass. I think Scharf is going to let this go. I think it's just not strong enough. Pass. Wow, the devilfish got it through. Must have been yeah, somewhere, decision. somewhere between genius and insanity, Vicky. Oh, yeah, yeah there I was saying that he doesn't have that much confidence tonight, but I was wrong. He Feels shoveled bad. it in with rubbish. Down, it's come good for him. He's laid down. See the leaderboard, and uh, they're packed in like sardines. Uh, I don't know. Do you think Helmuth and Tanny Duke seem to be the most on top of their game to right now? Tanny Duke, I think, is definitely very focused and is doing very well. Helmuth, I'm not really sure, Jesse. He's playing all sorts <laughs> of hands that I throw away at this point, but he's got 11 more bracelets than I have. It doesn't mean I'm not going to call you one of these hands. Do you, so you feel it? You the game it, just baby. got serious. It's no, the right. second four, level. Four. Four. And there was a bit of a hush as everyone looked at their cards and realized, hey... I could pick up nine points here in about 20 grand. Friends, right? You don't want to, because I'm a businessman, you don't want to raise under the gun. Makes sense. You want me in the game? What's this? Oh, wow. Germans. Look at Eddie. The Germans go coming Eddie. after the rest. It's like Scharf went Eddie. away go after the last tournament and came back. He's a totally different player. Know, he's, yeah. he's a pilot. Haven't German you met pilot. his brother? <laughs> 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 it's, uh... But I love this re-raise yeah. because... You know, even though he's got no hand, what is Kravchenko supposed to do? That is his punishment for raising under the gun with a medium ace. You know, what's he supposed to do? Yeah, and, you know, even though Scharf might have been an addict man, Vicky, in his first match, he didn't put the second raise in with Dogdo before. This is this is well, great stuff, still, if you want it? to buy a plane, you better buy get a good pilot, too, because <laughs> otherwise you're playing with... Well. No, Listen, a lot of these players have been insulting Eddie Schaaf to his face. To his face, Jesse. They just tell him that they uh, think he well, doesn't play the right, that he's not. Yeah, you know, the red at least with me, they do it behind my back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think he wants to prove something. You know his name? The others think he's steady Eddie, but Scharf can make moves with the best of them. The only German to win two World Series bracelets. And he was runner-up in Premier League 1. These 12 players, those one ego is bigger than the next. I mean, uh, Phil Helmuth wants to say I'm the best poker player of all time. I could care less. I don't care if if they consider me to be the best, which they won't. I just want to win this tournament. I opened for 80,000, <coughs> I did a million, and I won that pot, and I won the bracelet. So I figured if I made it 80, he's going to play any two again. How long till a break? <laughs> Soon. Wow. And yeah, he's he's played a couple loosey goosies up there, hasn't he? And he's folded this one. Yeah. These players all have sort of their own metronome in their head, don't they? Uh, I think maybe they're using that thing that. Uh, wasn't there a guy in Vegas, Jesse, who had put an electric button in his sock and whenever it buzzed, he raised? Tony G made a World Series of Maybe doing that. I was at that table. He beat me a big pot. When Devilfish won his world. Is well, Tony, does Tony right? smell something wrong? Well, well, look, I, I remember this feeling very clearly from my first heat. Two voices in your head. Well, one of them says, Eddie Scharf can't find this many big hands. The other one says, Eddie Scharf always has a hand. Tony's giving him the long look. Yeah. Has he just called? He has just called. He's just called it. I'd be surprised if Tony G checks the flop, whatever it is. It's going to come perfect for Scharf. Okay, I'm surprised. Actually, the four on the turn would be perfect for Scharf. Gosh, it'll be the end of Tony G, won't it? Well, Scharf obviously can quite happily make the continuation bet now. He's improved a lot on that flop. I'm all in. Oh, my gosh. All he's in? Well. What a play. <laughs> now, there's nothing Tony G could do. He had, he's got absolutely no options. If he planned a check raise, the dream is over. Finished. And it would be an astonishing call, but I don't think he's going to make it. <laughs> well, he 
be aware that the last time Eddie made a play like that, yeah, he was weak against Roland. Similar. But, uh, I want his all in. That's, that's what I'm Wow. A couple more hands, and it's, it's, it's almost like these guys have all run out of gas. Do you just get the feeling that it's like they've all talked themselves silly now? Well, they're all furious, Jesse. They've all got themselves involved with their ace six and their funny little cards, and nobody's had the chance to do anything with a really impressive flair apart from Eddie Scharf. He's been the class of the field so far, hasn't he? He really has. As TJ Cloutier says, the fish has got would you crabs. Get lucky or would you rather get lucky late? Anyway. Add your own second line to that if you like, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. And I mean, Tony's counting them up. He's got oh forty-eight thousand, oh, and he's gone all Devil in. This is an absolute perfect situation for him. Devilfish has one of two hands that Tony G has in in really bad shape. Yeah, I mean, fantastic instincts from Tony G because we've seen Devilfish raising with no, that's twenty-four with a range of really big hands and brilliant timing from Tony G to know that this time. Fours are good. Well, what sort of, what yeah. sort I of? Trip, I can't win one of these races. That's, even if I've got a race, if I'm lucky enough for it to be a race, I'll probably get stuffed. See, he's getting nearly two to one here, Vicky. I mean, if he thinks Tony has uh, over cards only, might he? Well, call? he know he knows that it's uh, you know over cards is absolutely at best. He, he can't have under cards. So you think you could actually like find a fold here with the devil fish? Yes, I I mean, the fish cannot afford to go out about first about here. Account. Actually, getting there's lots there in the bot 66,000. Well, I've got a pair and I'm getting two to one. It might be an even money. I might be a slight favorite. Okay. Nobody else had an ace out there. Mm -hmm. They've been raising, so I guess you might have an ace out there, Tony boy. So I guess I'm going to probably have to make this call. I don't like it at all. Oh, I can't remember the last time I won a race. Now that he's told Tony he has a pair. 29? I mean, Tony oh, must be dying here. here. How surprised oh, is Tony going to be to find out that it's an underbear? <laughs> He's going to be delighted. Out, <laughs> ah, he thinks it's two it's sevens. He knows it's not a big pair, Jesse, because it, you, any higher than sevens, Devilfish's money would be in the pot. Forget about it. I hope you got an ace eye, but I got a pair. Oh, he's done it. The fish could be going out with Look, no I points. Swear in my kid's life, I was going to say, well, my luck, you've probably got falls. Oh, yeah. With no yeah, points, the fish could be going. Have an overpair, Tony. Every time he's I'll got him pipped. Have you noticed that every time Tony gets all in, he's got him pipped? When I'm telling him I got a pair, I'm going to be shitting this. Small player. It's Tony G that's all in. Yeah, yeah. I got to move in. What, what, what can I do? I, yeah, it's like your magic. Let me win up. No, the the, the, the fish only covers. Uh, yeah. No, you're right. Covers Tony by about thirty thousand. This is a big pot. The third one, I've got to win. Wow! Oh! Well, There's the three. Yeah. I haven't won it yet. Buddy has looked well at the Full yeah. house for the Devilfish. Yeah. Astonishing yeah, yeah, turn of events. Like well, you know you don't like it, but don't uh, go I knew it. I had a bad feeling. I tell you what, I hope this stops the fish moaning about his luck oh. for a very yeah, long time. But <laughs> oh, the <laughs> third <laughs> king <laughs> means a big of applause for Tony G. This is a fucking joke or what, eh? Wow. I finally <laughs> fucking out flopped him, eh? Huh? Three is good. I called the king. Did you see well? it? I said catch a three. Lord almighty. He's drawing to one card. Yeah, he is. Ooh, it was a no spotter. Oh, wow. It was a no spotter. <coughs> oh, it's you've fun. got a feel for the devil fish there. Lucky. I mean, very unlucky. On that I mean, flop, the, he's already mentally spending the money. Favorite. Uh, next, if you'd have flopped, if, you'd, well, if, too, if, if anybody else, if anybody else would have flopped up against you, do you think you would have outflopped them? Look, I'm very lucky, but you know that. No, I mean, against me, I mean, but against anybody else. I think that was pretty funny and big under you when you were battling. So I was like, do you, do you think, do you think uh, if Phil had to flop that full house, you would have hit that fucking king? I'm a very lucky person. Is it scary or what? Well, he catches fucking running around. Run run Vicky, I mean, uh, three is a big underdog, but not after that flop. <laughs> it's unbelievable. It's as if the deck of cards itself knows that it's on television and wants to show a bit of razzle dazzle. <laughs> He only got about eight points in the last year's Premier League. If he ends up with a bagel here, you just don't know. Some of the biggest poker personalities around this felt, and you know these loud mouse will crash their brash. Stay tuned. I don't think I'll be laying kings down, especially against you. Two I know more hands in the second level. You've been waiting for kings, right? Sevens, I wanted eight. you to have kings. I well, in the next level, through. Devilfish is on very thin ice with only three is big blinds. He'd love to find a chance to get it in before that goes up. 
Or is that your dream? <laughs> okay. Oh, I, don't, I don't even think yeah, I appreciate it. You're honest. I don't even think This is the it. moment. <laughs> yeah, it's a good spot, depending on what he finds behind yes. him. How much is that? Tony G's got the oh, best hand. Oh, well, it's, um... It's only a lot if he's limping with Tony the big hand and you can raise your ass out of this. It's, it's, behind. it's only 15. I call. Call. Well, he's flat calling. Now it's a question of whether... The Russian will also flat call. They'll try to carve up a nice piece of fish between them. Yeah, I mean, and, and Tony G, he, he can't really isolate there, Vicky, can he? Because he, he has to be aware that Kravchenko could re-raise or... Well, Kravchenko's got a call. He's probably you know, really he's is. He's got straight back to him. He's small call. Yeah. Wow, well, well he was getting nearly four to one, one with, mm. to <laughs> with a nice hand. Oh, I'm not sure why he's passed that, but leaving oh, Tony G to I'm do the job you. alone. 8-10. Cheers, lads. It's been nice. Here, Jesse, and and you would have called there with Kravchenko's hand. Huh? I, I would have called, called with his hand, time. but. Who, 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 who it was dominated up? by Devilfish. Obviously, so I, I would have called if I'd seen Devilfish's hand, but. I've just said, see if I can get lucky and it holds up. Okay. I feel like the Kingpin's going to win. Yeah, of course it is. See you later, guys. Well played. See you. It's been lovely. Maybe tomorrow. There's still cards to come, you know. Yeah, it's okay. You can go. It's a big part, too. Elfish wants to, to <laughs> turn the cards over more quickly. He's got to walk really slowly now. <laughs> it was a good call by Tony G with Ace Nine with uh, with the little friend he sat waiting to re-raise it. I was only a five to one dog versus time I get my money in. So. Hey, Phil. <laughs> it's like Ace is against ten. It was a good call with Ace Nine with uh, Rusky and limped in the body. He might have been going to kick it up, stick it up in. And he ain't got no chips. King. Yeah, well, Ace I'll plays. A four or a dozen. Well, a lot more outs now for Devilfish to split the pot. That don't happen to me. I'll be happy with that. King or a ten to win it. Deuce or a four to split. <sighs> I think it's a nine. It's a oh, there <laughs> is. That's pretty sick. Wow. A nice nine hand. not needed for Tony nine G, but there it is, an eye. I don't you know why see? I waited. Who's got talent for cards? That, that's how you're good at poker. You know what, what's going to be the coming. river. This is like when they cut Samson's hair. You're Aren't protected. you happy? You didn't have to call he's with the He's feeling cursed. Huh? He doesn't believe yeah. he's going to be lucky, it, and he's not lucky. Yeah, yeah so aren't you it's happy that you didn't have to call with the 10 yeah, no, Circle no, no, of no. doom. One hand left in the second level, and the devil fish gone, Vicky. It's almost somber. It's very sad, really, because somehow it's like he walked into the room already crestfallen. And that there's several matches to go, and, you know, he could still turn it around, but... Only if he believes he can. Well, we know Tony G and a poker player. He ain't got much of a brain. But, you know, when I've moved in there, it's called with Ace Nine. Well, first of all, I might have him beat. You know, good chance I've got him beat. I mean, and secondly, um, the guy who's limped in, the rush key, is a pretty solid player. He could have easily been limping in there with a big hand, you know, hoping I'm going to move in or something. So Tony G could have been, been putting 15,000 in the pot and never see a flop because then the, the Russian raises and he has to throw his Ace Nine away. So it's a bad call with Ace Nine. But, you know, that's the secret of uh, being a good Nolan and Oldham player. You've got to get your money in bad shape and get lucky. How are you going to tease me about poker? You're not even on the same plane. Well, I mean, I'm just like cold call arrays in the, in the small blind or whatever. Yeah, you're not, even a, you're not even on the same planet. You see this? I have 11 of these. And I love drinking. <laughs> I love the fact that Annie Duke is finding hands at the start of this new level that's going to look well, like she's just picking up the pace for the bigger wow. blinds. Yeah, that's yeah, a very good yeah. point. I would worry. love to come over the top and make her now. pass, but uh, gonna step he's not going to do it with no hand. He's just not going to. It's not long now. You know, Annie's, I mean, she's capable of being, oh, wow. This, it's 11,000 more. Does Sharf have enough to peel off a flop? No, I don't need a hand either. Yeah, it's a very playable hand when you've got a lot of chips. Could we raise? You just said you're going to wait for good hands. Now you say you don't need a hand. I don't need a hand to re-raise. So well, now it's hard to imagine a flop that only That's one of them likes. Try to re-raise me. Try to re-raise me. Ooh. Okay. That's what oh, I it's a huge so flop. Okay. To me. <laughs> oh, a lot of chips just oh, have to go nothing. in here. Then I re you. Okay. Up and down with the middle pair for sure. Oh, Top pair. She's lumped it in and he's check-raised all in. I, I, I don't know. Eddie, did, did, did Eddie slip a cog here? Is he going to get called? Oh, 
She was going to have to think about it, though, Jesse, because it's the kind of flop that suits a calling hand. People call with nines, tens, I you know, know, king jacks, but she's made she the call. She called. I mean, Vicky, you know, if she, if she wheeled it back... It didn't feel like Sharf had wow, the Jack fast. King, Whatever did it? Whatever happened, I, I mean, got my money in good. Yep. You did. I mean, um, fast Annie's Eddie made a very gutsy Eddie. call here. And Annie is all seven, in. It must seven. be, uh, she loses to a 10, an 8, or a king. king nice. She doesn't want to make two pair. <laughs> <laughs> 10 is nice. Eight is oh! Nice. Yeah, it's, it's a straight for Eddie Sharf. He's headed. Good luck, folks. Oh, it was a great call from good Annie Duke, Annie. but... Well, no good. good call. What can I do? Update good luck. She's going to take one point. She said, very important not to get a zero or one. Five points in her first match, and now just a total of six through two. So bad, I know. With a ten jack against king, queen, often you get a flop that either both hands like or nobody does, and on that one, you know. Yeah, that was the story, and Sharf now will be a big chip leader. He caught the eight on the river to make the run. She right. If I'm going to play this strategy, I play the strategy. You're doing good. Uh, you didn't play when this tilting makes sense. Four does helmets. <laughs> oh, I'm <laughs> doing nothing. I mean, well, I haven't picked where is he going to get his chips? Really unlucky. Of course, of course. But yeah. when you're really unlucky, and you're still no, there, I've been picking good. up well, big hands. What helmets wants right? where he thinks I've he'll get his chips is from uh, well, I can't somebody cracking up and just shoving them over. That's not going to be Eddie Sharp. Four, sevens, that's good enough for you. But I already know. I already know. I got excuses. I know with you I'm going to have to beat the six or I got excuses Just if, like I, if I run last. Do you have excuses if you run last in this Premier League? You know that, that the sort of time I'm going to give you when, when you're running you last, coming run last? to the final how, heat? How can I run last? You can run last, believe me. Hmm. You could run stone motherless last. Everybody can run last. Everybody can six, run last. I can't run last. <laughs> <laughs> I can promise I can run last uh, throughout six now sit and goes? That's impossible. I mean, if Sharf ships it in, the helmet's going to hate it, but uh, I don't think he can pass. Not on this flop, anyway. I don't think Helmuth can get out of this No, I think Sharf is going to... However he plays it, I think Helmuth has got to put the chips in. I'd check it. How... Yeah. Uh, you know, if I was Sharp, I'd be tempted to raise here. The, the, oh, the no, call is terribly suspicious. Jeez, an alarm bell's gone off in Phil's head. Okay. Somebody has ze uh, zero points. Is Phil going to get away from this? Yeah, after two. No, not zero, but very few points. Devilfish have, he have one four. point. And, and still All Devil right. Ooh. You got me. You got me. One Only point. a six. For him, it's And really the cool. only other question is uh, if it doesn't yeah, come. Check it. Check. Full house now for Sharf, and you know if Helmer thought he was ahead on the turn, he's got to think he's ahead he on the river. He can't qualify unless he he's to got win. to think that. If you don't win, he can't qualify. Seventeen thousand. He's got to make the call. Yeah. Cool. Oh, he's gonna be horrified. Very solid. When he calling. sees Sharf's hand. Oh, he hates it. Ice high. He really wants to make so a sarcastic yeah, comment now. Tony's uh, sticking the needle five in right something now. Of space. I fold Maybe it's not my Tony, day. Tony, I, fold. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> it is. Kick a problem. I fold ace five of them. You sure you're going to kick a problem? <laughs> <laughs> Must be five of space. Yeah, I mean, two <laughs> pair on the flop makes Helmuth's hand. I had an overpair. I mean, how hard is it good. It's not like it doesn't come over Well, I yeah. mean, how hard is it to figure There's out? There's two pairs on the board. Yeah, well, could. how hard is it to figure yeah, out? You think I called 10,000 on the turn on a draw? Do you think you played good? Uh -huh. is, that, is that how you want everybody at home to play it? Like, leap I was, in with a big you, pair? I was so unlucky there. Let two there. pairs come on the board and then just don't call for chips. I was so unlucky there. This is fast Eddie. All he did is... I watched the commentary. He played every I mean, what, hand, and now he shows up. What did up I do? I, I was in the big blind. I couldn't help it. I, I wanted to fold. I wanted, but he didn't raise. Then he checked. You bet yeah. because you and you're yeah. greedy. You know. <laughs> 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 then, then actually, you know, I, I didn't want to everything, embarrass him. That's you know, why when I they bet. Put bad beats on me. Everything's funny. Everything's funny. I bet <laughs> on the river because I don't want to embarrass him and have to did show him like my hand. Did you like the way you played you know? the hand? Ha 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 ha! Everything's funny when they hit the miracles. You call half your stack on the river. Don't call half your stack. I had queen and you high. still try to justify it. 
I had Queen High. How can you justify yourself in the face of adversity and poor play? <laughs> in the face of it. You can't justify it. The difference, you can't even talk to me. I mean, you're like, you're like, you know what, I'm like, I'm listen, like on the world's tallest ladder and you're like four me. steps up. And listen I'm up to like 10,000 steps. When you're on this table, as we're soon in the as same you can league. Get, as even, as when you, even when you get to like the 5,000th step, if you ever make it that far, by then I'll be up to the 30,000th step. So. You can't ever talk to me in life about poker, I don't think. Believe me one thing, when we're on this table, we're on equal footing. No matter who you are, how big your head is, right, and you it doesn't you're count. Still what playing. counts we, we, is how you perform on the day, that's what people remember. It's performance to fold every single hand. I have the best performance hand. in the whole world, so, and, I, and I, I have the best results in the whole world. That's why you're so good. That's why you're <laughs> well, so on, special. Yeah, it, it, I mean, it, 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 it takes uh, sap uh, somewhere yeah, between a month and a year to drip all the way down from the top of the tree to the bottom. And I mean, uh, two and a half to one, two point two to one. He's very moving, very slowly down the tree. This Phil Helmuth tonight, isn't he? Well, I remember in the last series, he often picked up points just by waiting. When he had such a short stack that you Can felt you most it? people would stick it all Maybe in, he waited fall. and recouped. You never know. Although this, he cannot pass. He just doesn't have enough chips. He's, they've got well, to go in. Hand. He's Please. considering calling oh, no, here. I know he something. is. <laughs> or I'm going to call one of the two. It's because he hates to do anything mundane. That's what he thinks. Oh, your average day-to-day -day internet player would move all in with Ace-4. Therefore, I mustn't. But he must. That's what he's got to do. It's the correct all play. Right, 14,000. Yeah, there it is. If someone's got a better hand than that, you're unlucky. I'm not going to look... Because I'm from the street. Well, that is a nice <laughs> hand for Tony G. Very nice. We both have a well, nice. He's not a big favourite, yeah. Helmuth, but you know, it was right to put no, in the chips. 14,000 should be. No, if he's right. a favourite at all. It's we both have a oh, nice hand, right? If you go out, you can't complain. But you can tell everyone you complain. went out with the best hand. I, I think I'm going <laughs> to win this. What do you this. think, Alex? <laughs> I can't believe it. I think you want I'm going to win this. You, you want insurance? No. Thing? I think I'm going to win. <laughs> you you like win. Yeah, I think I'm going to win. Let's have a million dollar side bet on it. A million dollar side bet? Let's have a million dollar side bet on it. Well, Elmer should, should, should take no, this bet minus because minus he's, oh, he's no. you know, he's nearly 4 to 6 favorite. A million dollar side bet, mine, minus 2%. Mm -mm. That's generous. For a, for a guy that's buying jets, <laughs> that's, not that's not my style, you know that. <laughs> Coming second is no good. If I win, I'm, I'm in the f final four. You guys, I don't even have to turn up. 18 points is not guaranteed to be top I'm going to score at least one point, aren't I? There oh, we go. there's the that queen. The queen. Yeah. See, I made a mistake. I thought yeah. it was going to be the jack. That that's was a really bad read on your part. Maybe five. a jack will come too. You don't want a jack, do you? <laughs> no, no, You'd no. You'd like no. to see a three. Three would like be good. No, I want to see an ace. I know. <coughs> Deuce, that's good. Now I want to see now a three. Now you've got multi, multi outs. Well, I need a no spotter. Like one where you I'll can't see any eyes. of the close spots. Close your eyes, I'll tell you. It's an ace, a deuce, a three. Close like your zero eyes. spots. Phil, close your eyes and hold on tight, <laughs> and I'll tell you what it is. He's referring to the way <laughs> you can no squeeze win, the cards. Way. The side of them, and it, it <laughs> narrow it down to just three. Nah. No good, and helmet's <laughs> out. Just two well points done. for him. Well done. Two points twice now, Vicky. And uh, well done. I don't think he picked up a bike hand all day, sure. Phil Helmut. You got a bike? <laughs> and uh, looking at the pie, three-handed now. Sharf, nearly half the chips in play. And you know, Eddie really needs to take this down. He could really use a win. It's one of those days, but I mean, wow. And everybody else, they're playing so badly. I mean, they're, they're really playing poorly. They're moving in with threes and fours and six deuces and all these crazy hands. And uh, I mean, I don't, you know, I don't need much luck. I mean, but give me average luck, and I'm going to make the top three almost every day. Eddie was, he sort of had a disappointed third in his first match, and lay down. I think if he gets third again, it'll be another disappointed third, won't it? He. But, these are two tough guys to convert through, aren't they? What's Sorry. happening here? Cool. <laughs> he wants to give Kravchenko actually with the uh, the threes. Twenty-one. Raise twenty-one thousand. Well, look at that. They both limp on Tony G's <laughs> big blind. G is having none of it. He says, "I've got six deuce. I want to raise it." It's an odd little raise. Uh, I mean, what is Alex supposed to think with his two threes? He could re-raise. We wouldn't. We wouldn't do that. Well, I, you know, he hasn't been looking to mud wrestle with Tony G so far, and I think he's going to move out of the way here, actually. Short stacked. Pass. 
Well, that's one the pot shaft's not going to play it. And, you know, that's a sign of a great player because so many people, they find six deuce or the big blind. They gratefully accept a free flop. <laughs> <laughs> Shows uh, Tony G has got the heart and the commitment to win the pot. I'm saying now, look how it's boring it is because nobody's talking. Yeah. You know? And maybe they, should, maybe they should have some kind of ruling. I mean, I should be upset in the Russian anyway. He's <laughs> been thinking about that. Price to 17,000 token. <coughs> but you do think if a German, <coughs> a Russian, and an Australian sit at a poker table, don't don't you just generally imagine the Aussie's going to crack first? <laughs> <laughs> How much you Certainly, you imagine the banter will be phenomenal. <laughs> how much Alex wants to know how much okay. Tony G is playing. Two hundred. He's, he's got a, about. 70,000 more than Alex. And this is really the first time they've played a flop together that's got some money in it. Kravchenko's uh, off to the races. Well, there's no way Tony oh. G is passing middle pair. I mean, Alex will sort of take an alarm bell that he's behind, but does that mean he can't win it? Well, now he's got a straight draw, Kravchenko. And overs. Has he gone all in? What did he say? No, Tony G checked. And Kravchenko is thinking whether to bet. He said something. What do you have? An, an eight or a king? One of those, you're right. Got one of those ones. Oh, did he say all in, Tony G? No. Alex said, what do you have? An eight or a king? And Tony said, you're right. I've got one of those. And, I mean... Check. So they both check the turn. Just wonder if uh, if Alex gave away the strength of his hand there. Well, Tony G did. He, he, he told uh, Kravchenko what he had. Oh yeah, but besides that, <laughs> uh, poker would be so easy if people always did that. You're yes, right. that's right. I have sure. a pair. And uh, that pot has not only swung Tony G over the oh, I think the two hundred and uh, fifty thousand mark. But uh, it's not Kravchenko down a big lump. I mean, if, yeah. you, if you guessed more, you, you would have got him right. I mean, you guessed two cards. The eight was the first one. Pressure is on you. I don't have chips. No. <laughs> no but you can, how you can have pressure when you don't have you're chips? You're under pressure. You got you're five under pressure. points. You're afraid to make a mistake. Yes. I'm, I am. I'm, I'm not I'm always pressure. afraid to I'm mistake. just waiting for a hand. I understand. I'm not you're under pressure. under pressure. No, I got no hands. Sorry. I kind of like the way Kravchenko's doing this. You know, he's thinking sooner or later one of you guys is going to crack up. Will make a mistake. And, um, Possibly. <laughs> a check. I don't think these Give guys are going to crack up. <laughs> they might. Set up. Eddie Schaff giving the free here. Mm. Trips both. But uh, it's very interesting oh. for him because check. middle pair in Tony G's hand may get action. But Schaff just checks. Well, that's kind of killed it. Ten thousand. And obviously, it's not a huge bet. But doesn't Sharf have to think about the river? How big is the river going to be? Well, he's hoping it's going to be king sized. Oh, three ten Dress. for Tony G. Twenty thousand. Does. I mean, can Eddie change his mind here? But there's, there's no hand he's beating apart from a bluff now, is there really? I mean, Tony G could have had the ace all along. He could have hit the queen or he could have the... T I mean, he Whatever had dropped, nothing. it was random. Whatever <laughs> dropped out, he could have been lucky. It might have been like 15,000. Lines up to 7 and 15,000 now. Queen, and queen jack of clubs. This one has been like metal on wood. A grind. Right, queen deuce. But Alex now on the short oh, stack. Doesn't have money 26. left. In they go. I, don't, I can't. It's not even look. double the big blind. With, uh, so far, of course, I the, I mean, well, nice. Ricky, if, if Kravchenko Most? comes back and wins the this match from here, I'm and then I'll buy you a hat. What do you have? A, Jim, a Jimmy Choo nine. hat. <laughs> I lost per force the final hand. I don't know if they're doing hats if you so flop before, you're not going to win it. Well, can you I wear, you wear your shoes on, on my head? You can't win it. Yeah, he's all in. I better stand up, though. Yeah, it's been shake, lucky for shake the hands. <laughs> shake our hands. <laughs> 26, 
16, yeah. You'll get it. Well, there's the eight. The date with an eight. In pretty good form. Five or seven will make it interesting. You know what? It felt. <laughs> it just felt, Vicky, like Kravchenko was playing a great game. I don't Dayton really know what happened. It fell to pieces. It fell to pieces at the last double. He let Peace himself space. get into a situation Good where he's all in for less Good than the minimum bet. I mean, that's what happened there. And, uh, he's going to have eight points anyway through two matches, which I believe is going to keep him in uh, the top now. four. Yeah. Heads up break. They have to count the chips. They seem to have the been uh, avoiding each other, but working up now for the face-off. What do you see in it? They obviously can't avoid each other now. There's only two of them. And uh, I'm sure Tony G will be picking up the aggressive pace and uh, raising a lot more. And uh, it may come down to whether Eddie Scharf is still feeling feisty like he was at the beginning. Scharf on the button here with the small blind. Yeah, I mean, obviously, points not only get you to the final table, Vicky, but translate to chips on the final table. It's all... Everything translates to prize money and prestige at the end of the day. Now well, this matchup wouldn't translate into prize money for Tony G. Of course, most likely neither of them hit the flop. It wasn't a huge raise, 15 to 35 from Scharf. Check. And Is Tony G check passing here? Scharf can't call a raise. I don't know. Eddie's got his. Oh, here, this is it, and this there is pressure. There we go. And he's picked a. His timing is good yeah, here. This is the beautiful. first move he's made on Eddie tonight. It's a lovely bet. He knows that looks like a caller's flop. Check raising. Yeah. Lovely. Plus. That's lovely, and and a big swing actually, Vicky, because uh, by taking that pot, instead of giving it up, he's knocked Eddie down to about 150. Yeah, it's a, it's um, a three to one chip lead for Tony yeah, G. Yeah, it's it's a free shot. Ever since Tony got the chip lead, he's never looked <coughs> like he's in danger of going out. It's it's kind of been a rare display of tactical genius. Cool. You don't really expect that from Tony, do you? Well, I guess he's uh, demonstrating extra moves. You know. It will be absolutely dominant in his mind that in the last Premier League he played too fast. Wasn't the right strategy. He's got to do it differently. Jeez, if he, if he ends up with 18 points here, I mean, after being virtually... He laughed off the table by Helmuth in Premier League 1. He's going to have a, a, a points lead on the field. 17,000. Basically nailed on. Cool. And what a call from <laughs> Eddie Sharp. Does he know he's in front with 10 6? Do you think he's going to lead at it or is his plan to check raise? Check. I don't know what his plan is. I mean, maybe he knows he's in front. Jeez, this pot's 64K. Tony has to fire another bullet. Oh, yeah. He has to. I mean, if Scharf's playing to check raise, then he deserves to win the pot. If he calls on the flop and check raises the turn with that hand, Scharf deserves to win. But I think if G does bet again, it'll be enough to take it. 35,000. I mean, either Eddie called here. Oh, oh, wow. That's just beautiful. Oh. That's just gorgeous <laughs> poker. I love it. He calls on the flop with nothing, Jesse. He's got 10 seconds on no hand. He calls and he check raises the turn. It's just magnificent. I mean, I don't like flying, but if this guy was in the cockpit, I might actually relax and enjoy it. I think this guy knows what he's doing. It was <laughs> great stuff by Eddie. I mean, there's a lot, obviously, all the Premier League players are watching this, are going to be aware of, of what Eddie's doing. Uh, You've seen it. Do you have to rate him differently the next time you play with him? No, I always rated him. I always did. I think the other players are dismissive of him because they think he plays too slowly. Uh, Tony's hit the pair Check. on the bottom Check. angle. Yeah, a bit of an outdraw there for Tony G. Ooh. 
You know that? Oh, the chips could go back the other way now. And it just won't be Shaft's fault if they do. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm guessing he's called there to call the river as well, Vicky. He needs the jack. That oh, he, Shaft's got to pay him off on the river. He's got to pay him off. He hasn't called yet. Yeah, there it goes. No, he's called. But that's such a shame because 15 he, shot. he won those chips so beautifully the hand before. Now he's shipping them over on uh, simply a hand he can't get away from. It's a pity. What's the, what's the hand? Two pair. Two pair. Oh, two pair. I didn't see the two. All in. All in. This is what he's got to do. Call. He's got to move in. Oh, there's a call from Tony G, but he's done nothing wrong, Eddie Sharp. Well, the, the quick call, you, you, you're guessing it's better than Queen 8. Um, well, it is, but Sharp's got a yeah. chance. And it is a 200,000 plus pot. Uh, 260, actually. This would. Uh, <laughs> you're happy you got would... that one instead of like Jack 8. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. He's, he's picked a good time here, Eddie, because this would bring him back just about to where he started the heads up. The although he is he's a dog. You got oh, these. You got big, one. big one. Pair each. I knew I had to hit it. <laughs> Doesn't actually change anything. No, Sharp still needs a queen or an eight. Or a queen. Jack will keep you alive. Tony yeah, G's on the verge of running point. away with Thank this you. Premier League. Nine. Ooh, that was close. No I mean, help. dominating. Come on. Come on. Yeah, pair if the it comes eight. blank on the end, Tony yeah, G is soaring yeah, in front. You try to pair with an eight. In points. <laughs> Come on. Yes! Wow. Baby! Another first place flush. for Tony G. <laughs> yeah. I'm not that down. Hold on. <laughs> After four league matches, every player has been in action twice, and the win from Tony G. How dominant is he? His final table placing is not confirmed, but his ticket is booked with 18 points. Also in the promotional zone, Black and the Wolf and Sharf. The second place tonight has catapulted him to the good showing. In the playoff zone, third place tonight from Kravchenko has kept him with eight points. And disappointing result for Annie Duke, but still hanging in there with six. Marcel Lusk as well in the playoff zone. But the relegation zone, big danger, Phil Helmuth. He'll be in action next time along with Fraser and Helpy, and he'd better get his game in gear or get dizzy fallen. Very disappointing from the Devilfish tonight. The bagel to go along with his one point from before. He better get his head together or get out of the Premier League. It's been amazing and I, I want to go for the clean sweep. I want to win all six now. I'm, I'm just feeling it and I, I could do it. And that's what I want to try. I know the odds are not the best, but I could do it. I've got the heart and commitment to the game to do this. 18 points for Tony G so far. Next time, defending champion Yuha Helpy and Phil Helmuth in trouble and needing points here on the Party Poker Premier League. Okay.